Pluto, a distant and enigmatic celestial body, was once part of our solar system's planetary family. However, recent alarming statements from prominent astrophysicists like Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku have thrust Pluto back into public attention. They have made a startling revelation Pluto might be on a potential collision course with Neptune. But how could such an event happen and what would the consequences be? Is this a rare cosmic anomaly or is there something more to this imminent cosmic impact? Join us as we explore the possibilities of a potential Pluto-Neptune collision. Pluto once classified as a planet, but later redefined as a dwarf planet due to its peculiar orbit, continues to captivate the scientific community. According to recent research by leading scientists, Pluto's trajectory is dangerously close to Neptune's orbit. Renowned astrophysicists like Tyson and Kaku are raising alarms about the potential for a catastrophic collision between these two planets, a scenario that could pose a significant threat to Earth. But how could such an event come to pass? Unlike any other planet in our solar system, Pluto's journey around the Sun is highly unusual. It takes a remarkable 248 years to complete just one orbit. Since its discovery in 1930, Pluto hasn't even finished one full orbit which adds to its mystique. But Pluto's orbit is not just slow, it's also highly elliptical, vastly different from the more circular orbits of the larger planets. To complicate things, further Pluto's orbit is tilted at an angle of 17 degrees to the plane of the solar system. This inclination makes its path much more extreme than the other planets, adding layers of complexity to its movement. One of the most intriguing aspects of Pluto's orbit is its interaction with Neptune's orbit. For roughly 20 years of each orbit Pluto comes closer to the Sun than Neptune does define what we might expect based on the relative positions of planets in our solar system. This naturally raises the question why hasn't Pluto collided with Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational influences of other celestial bodies, especially the large planets. The study of Pluto's orbit began shortly after its discovery. Early astronomers were puzzled by its strange path. Unlike other planets whose orbits are somewhat aligned with the ecliptic plane Pluto's orbit stood out due to its steep tilt and elliptical nature. The realization that Pluto's orbit crosses Neptune's was a major point of scientific curiosity. Despite these irregularities, the stability of Pluto's orbit is a remarkable feature of space mechanics. The phenomenon known as the three-body problem comes into play when studying the movements of Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun. This problem involves understanding the way three celestial objects move and affect each other through gravitational forces. Predicting their paths is a complex task, and this is where terms like AIML libration scope libration and VZK wobbling become relevant. The concept of AIML libration refers to the fact that when Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit it remains at least 90 degrees away from Neptune ensuring their paths do not intersect. Scope libration describes the vertical movement of a celestial body in its orbit. For Pluto, this means that when it gets closest to Neptune or any other large planet, it is positioned above the plane of their orbits, offering extra protection from potential collisions. Another crucial factor is VZK wobbling named after the researchers VZ and K, who studied how space objects interact through gravitational forces. This phenomenon explains how Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun's gravitational pulls influence each other, keeping Pluto's path stable despite its apparent erratic behavior. Even though Pluto's orbit may seem unpredictable, this wobbling mechanism helps maintain its steady motion over long timescales. These complex forces help ensure Pluto's orbit remains stable, preventing it from crashing into Neptune or deviating wildly. The three-body problem is essential for understanding how orbits change due to the gravitational influence of multiple objects. Studying this helps us gain a deeper understanding of Pluto, our solar system, and even distant celestial bodies and their stars. Mathematical simulations conducted in the late 1980s revealed that although Pluto's orbit has these stabilizing factors, it is still chaotic. Small changes in its starting conditions could lead to significant variations over millions of years. Despite this inherent chaos, Pluto's orbit remains stable over incredibly long timescales, effectively keeping any potential disruption in check. Recent computer models have provided new insights into how the gravitational influences of giant planets like Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn affect Pluto's orbit. These models show that Pluto's relationship with Neptune is unique. For every two orbits that Pluto completes around the Sun, Neptune completes three. This relationship helps to stabilize Pluto's orbit. But Neptune is not the only force at work. Jupiter's gravity plays a key role as does Saturn's providing additional stability. These simulations demonstrate that Jupiter's gravitational pull alone is strong enough to ensure Pluto remains in a stable orbit for billions of years. 
Together Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn work in tandem to keep Pluto safely on its course avoiding any catastrophic collisions or other disruptions. Understanding Pluto's orbit is crucial to gaining a clearer picture of our solar system's dynamic nature. Pluto's case serves as a prime example of how even the most seemingly unstable orbits can achieve stability through the intricate interplay of gravitational forces. It also underscores the importance of continuous observation and exploration to better understand our place in the universe. The study of Pluto and its orbit illustrates the unpredictable nature of celestial mechanics. The concept of orbital chaos, which refers to the extreme sensitivity of a body's orbit to its initial conditions, is clearly visible in Pluto's case. Even the smallest change in Pluto's position or speed could significantly alter its orbit over time. Simulations have played a pivotal role in helping researchers understand Pluto's motion. These computer models use complex mathematics to simulate how Pluto and other celestial bodies interact gravitationally. By tweaking small variables astronomers can see how tiny changes can drastically alter Pluto's long-term orbit. While Pluto's orbit appears stable today, its future remains uncertain. Over time, even minor shifts in the gravitational forces between Pluto-Neptune and other planets could lead to a catastrophic event. Kaku's predictions underscore the vulnerability of Pluto's orbit despite its current stability. Although current models suggest that a collision with Neptune is unlikely in the near future, the unpredictable nature of celestial dynamics means that we can never fully rule out such a possibility. Gravitational interactions with other celestial bodies will continue to shape Pluto's trajectory. While the likelihood of Pluto colliding with Neptune any time soon seems remote the inherent uncertainty in predicting celestial dynamics over such vast timescales means that anything is possible. The forces at play in orbital mechanics are powerful and intricate, and even the slightest change can accumulate over billions of years potentially leading to major shifts in the orbits of distant objects. Ultimately, the study of Pluto and its relationship with Neptune is not just about these two distant worlds, but about the broader quest for knowledge and understanding in astrophysics. The universe is full of surprises, and as technology advances we will continue to unlock its secrets one revelation at a time. The idea of a potential collision between Pluto and Neptune is a fascinating one, but it is important to separate scientific reality from speculation. While Pluto's orbit is indeed eccentric and tilted relative to the plane of the solar system astrophysicists have long understood that a collision between Pluto and Neptune is virtually impossible due to a well-established gravitational mechanism known as a mean motion resonance. Why Pluto will not collide with Neptune. Orbital resonance 3 colon 2 resonance with Neptune. Pluto and Neptune are locked in a 3 colon 2 orbital resonance, meaning that for every three orbits Neptune completes around the Sun, Pluto completes exactly two. This gravitational relationship prevents their orbits from ever intersecting in a way that would lead to a collision. Inclined and eccentric orbit. Pluto's orbit is not only highly elliptical, but also inclined at about 17 degrees relative to the plane of the solar system. This means that even when Pluto crosses Neptune's orbital distance, it is actually far above or below Neptune, avoiding a direct encounter. Long-term stability of Pluto's orbit. Detailed computer simulations and orbital calculations have shown that Pluto's orbit remains stable over billions of years. The combined gravitational influences of Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn help maintain the stability ensuring that Pluto never comes too close to Neptune. The role of Lagrange points and librations. The gravitational interactions between Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun create a stable configuration known as libration which keeps Pluto from getting too close to Neptune even over vast timescales. This is an example of how celestial mechanics can create order out of apparent chaos. Could Pluto's orbit change in the future? While Pluto's current orbit is stable long-term gravitational perturbations from other planets passing stars or hypothetical interactions with unknown celestial bodies could theoretically alter its path over millions or billions of years. However, even in extreme scenarios a direct impact with Neptune remains unlikely. One of the most significant factors that could change Pluto's orbit is the gradual evolution of the Sun. Over billions of years, as the Sun enters its red giant phase and loses mass the gravitational balance of the solar system will shift. This could slightly alter the orbits of distant objects like Pluto, but any significant effects would take place on timescales much longer than human civilization. Is a Pluto-Neptune collision possible? Based on all available scientific models and calculations, a collision between Pluto and Neptune is not a concern. Their resonant orbital relationship and the three-body interactions with the Sun ensure that their paths remain stable. 
However, Pluto's case is a great example of how chaotic yet predictable celestial mechanics can be. While small changes in initial conditions can lead to complex orbital variations over time, the fundamental gravitational laws keep Pluto and Neptune in a stable cosmic dance. The real mysteries of Pluto lie not in its potential for collision but in its geological activity atmosphere and history. Future space missions may further uncover Pluto's secrets, but one thing is certain Pluto will continue to orbit safely for billions of years, posing no threat of colliding with Neptune.